What's up folks, this is Sacrificio, and in this episode I'm going to bring you some tips and tricks on how to attack with 10 dragons. In this first attack, I'm actually going to use a, a simple strategy with uh, 3 lightning spells. My uh, Barbarian King, which is unfortunately still only level 4, though I'll update it very very soon, and 10 dragons. So I found a base that has enough resources for me to attack. Unfortunately, the air defenses are all sort of in the center. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my lightning, all three lightning, on one of the air defenses to take it out. And normally what I'd next do is I'd look for the strongest side of the base to attack that side of the base. But in this case, because I'm purely trying to take down all of those resources, I'm actually going to spread my dragons around the base and take out all of the collectors. You can see there's quite a lot of loot inside those collectors, so I'm going to try to take them out. Now the only risk with an attack like this is that I do risk not 3-starring the base. In fact, uh, if I don't get to that town hall, I might not even 2-star the base. But, uh, but to me, honestly, in this attack, it's very important that I clear all of the resources. And as you can see, pretty much all of the resources are inside those collectors, so that's the most important thing for me. So I've deployed all of my uh, uh, dragons around the base. I had an 11th dragon inside my clan castle, thanks to my clan mates for that one. And uh, as you can see, I've actually almost collected all of the resources, which makes this, to me, uh, personally, a successful attack. Here's the trick, though. Can I get the remaining air defenses before they get me? Uh, honestly, an attack like this, where I've spread out the dragons all around the base, I'm, I'm, I'm unlikely to get them all. Uh, what you're going to see in my next two attacks, um, I'm actually going to run a replay of my uh, clan attacks in the, clan, in the most recent clan war I had. Uh, what I did in those attacks was I actually focused on the three star and um, the the basic strategy here uh, for my clan attacks I used rage spells instead of lightning and you know because dragons will follow a trajectory that's basically following the nearest building uh, the strategy is find the most powerful side and attack the most powerful side but make sure your dragons go directly for the air defenses first and the way you do that, um, as you're going to see now, um, I'm going to start the replay of my first uh, Clan Wars attack. What I'm going to do is I'm going to try to clear out a few buildings on either side of the air defenses on the strongest side of the base. So uh, first of all, I'm using my Barbarian King here to clear out the army camp. I'm then going to use my Clan Castle on the right hand side to clear out some of those buildings. Now when I start dropping my dragons, they should go straight for the center buildings uh, inside the base. Uh, once they get close enough to the air defenses, that's when I'm going to start dropping rage spells. Uh, this is a pretty simple strategy, and uh, honestly, it's, it works quite well for me. Um, I've only just started using it, and um, I'm pretty happy with the results so far. So, uh, what I paid attention to here, because this was my first attack on this particular clan, what I paid attention to was what came out of the clan castle. And based on what came out of the clan castle, I'm actually less nervous about grouping all of my dragons because uh, there were only a couple of wizards and uh, mostly archers there. So uh, archers all, all grouped up. They're going to go single attack on my dragons, so I'm not too concerned about uh, attacking my next base with dragons in a, in a bunch. Um, here we go. I'm approaching the last air defense now, and uh, I, I have dropped all of my rage spells. So... Basically, I just... Oh, that's bad luck. You see how the the uh, Barbarian King lured away my dragon? <laughs> if not for that, he actually would have killed that air defense because he was focused on uh, on that particular spot. But oh well, um, that looks like uh, that was the bad luck point that, that forced me into a two-star victory in this one. So in the next clip, I'm going to show you what I learned from the first two clips. Uh, first of all, when you're attacking with dragons, it's very important to attack the strongest part of the base first. So in this case, it's the bottom right-hand side. I'm going to drop all of my dragons here. I'm not worried about the clan castle throwing out a whole lot of wizards because I saw the previous attack in the clan castle. There weren't that many wizards. So here you see a whole lot of archers. Um, next, I'm going to drop my ra Rage Potions when I'm close enough for those air defenses to hit me. And the idea here is that the dragons will destroy buildings fast enough that they go straight to those air defenses and destroy them. Once the air defenses are down, I can safely attack the rest of the base. Um, the strategy here with dragons on the, on the outside of the base is to try to, uh, try to not let them uh, go around the outside of the base with those outer buildings. And in this case, what I did is I dropped my Barbarian King, and hopefully the Barbarian King will go out there and clear those structures before the dragons are distracted by them. Unfortunately, up the top, you can see the dragons are still following the Barbarian King. 
Now my dragons on the left are getting close enough to the air defenses that they can take it out. Uh, a few more air bombs and uh, they should be safe. I have enough of them there that I'm not too worried about it. Uh, and once that air bomb is taken out, I'm pretty safe to clear the rest of the base. So once again, just to recap on the strategy, focus on the area of the base that has the most air defense. Drop your dragons in a way that they will go straight towards the air defenses. If you have to clear buildings on the left and right of the pathway, do that first. And once they're close enough that they're getting hit by the air defense, drop the, the rage potion so that they run straight in and destroy the air defenses. Thanks very much for watching. I hope the 10 dragon attack video was useful for you. I will put out many, many more videos. So please don't forget to click subscribe underneath the video on YouTube and you'll be able to see all of the future videos I produce. Thanks very much for watching. Bye for now.